there are very few of us, and it's not very often that you see somebody like me, if at all, in your lifetime. And people with disabilities are the largest minority group with the least amount of representation. Hi there, I'm Will Butts, and I'm missing ten toes and seven fingers, but I can do the exact same things that you can. I enjoy running and track and field and cross country and spending time outside, playing with my neighbors. I enjoy swimming and reading and playing some video games. Will is a typical kid living a very typical life. He just happens to do everything without the hands and feet that the rest of us use. I love to run track and I love running in general. That's one of my favorite things to do and it's probably my favorite sport. And I enjoy doing that because I've made a lot of friends over the years in different areas. I go all across America running. Will, this summer, decided he wanted to see video game characters that look like him. What I'm trying to do is promote inclusion in video games because I want to be able to add people like me in those games. People who are different from your average everyday human. People like me who are missing ten toes and seven fingers, or who are in wheelchairs, or who need the help of braces or different prosthetics to get around. I think that it would be really cool for a Fortnite character to be like me. Maybe blades or prosthetics. Will wants to ask video game companies to include characters that look like him. He wants representation. People in wheelchairs or people with disabilities I feel should be included in Fortnite and other video games. Some of us might look differently and some of us might think differently, but we're all humans and every human should have representation in this world. So yes, I am so proud of him for taking ownership of who he is and for running with it. Why not? Why can't video games include all kinds of characters? Mm -hmm.